Well, oh, hi. Uh, what we show today is the Intel add-on processor. It's actually the midst of the uh, smart IP cameras. Inside is the uh, showing the video uh, recording capability of 1080p, 30 frames per second. And also another is a cool function of it is that you're able to do a video analytics by the same uh, box inside the camera. So what we're showing here is the uh, be able to extract the objects, all the moving objects in the back uh, in the scene here. You can differentiate whether is it uh, vehicles, humans, or left and unpended objects. So for example, you can see on the side here, it will extract the objects, and put the snapshots, and showing the uh, details, information. For example, the size of the objects. Uh, speeds of the object, directions of the object, as well as colors and timestamps. So we collected this information and make it a time synopsis space, compress it, and what we see here is the... Um, it's all the uh, summary of the uh, an hour of recorded videos. So what you see is that each of the object has a timestamp. So it means Ladies that when it comes into the pictures in or videos, so it will show the time of the objects. So it helps the police departments to really increase their efficiencies of investigations. Because usually when something happens, they need to sit down there and watch a lengthy length of videos, of hours of videos. Now they can able to do it in less than two minutes for an hour of video footage. So it helps them to correlate each of the object uh, connections. And for example, if there's a hit and run cases, they can just look at the two minutes videos and understand what's the root cause and how it can get happened. So another areas of implementation could be a mall, shopping mall, so you can count the people, flow counting, and do some video uh, analysis in terms of um, which shopping, uh, I would say retail shop is more popular. Then it helps to uh, the owner to have some business intelligence things uh, going on. Right. So everything is running on the IP cameras here. It used to be running at the back end, but nowadays with the Intel add-on processor, we're able to uh, up to move the workload and into the camera, make it real time. So the backend can spend more time to process uh, information like those data mining, data collections, and business intelligent applications.